everybody. It's your favorite uncle, Uncle Gentleman. And this morning I'm a little nervous. Uh, we are right now uh, on our way to uh, the clinic, doctor's office, uh, because your favorite uncle is at that age where it's time to get the colon checked. So I'm going in for my very first colonoscopy. Um, yeah, uh, yesterday was not fun at all. Uh, I spent a very large amount of my day on the toilet and it sounded like I was peeing when I wasn't. <laughs> it was, it, it was unpleasant. And uh, I was supposed to have uh, this done, procedure done later this afternoon, but the doctor's office called and said, hey, we got a cancellation, can you come now? And I was like, I can be there in an hour. So we are now on our way to the place and uh, so I can get a hose shoved up my butt. So. I have my driver. <laughs> it's going to be there to uh, film and laugh at me. Uh, so uh, this should be interesting. So stay tuned. Oh. Hey, it's Uncle Gentleman. And um, I'm not quite lucid let yet. I have uh, hoses, hoses on me. Um, I'm totally double chinning it. Uh, it wasn't bad. Like it felt really like quick, even with a nap. I felt like I slept pretty good. Uh, I'm a little, I'm a little loopy still, so this is going to be a thing, but um, my uh, nether reasons aren't hurting near like I was like, hey, they shoved a uh, hose in my butt. I thought it'd be worse. Oh. Uh, hey. <laughs> I, uh, the doctor came in and talked to me. Said everything for the most part looked pretty good. They found a couple of like little polyps and he took it out. Well, it was um, under, so it looks good. And uh, they were going to check everything out, and then they were going to decide if uh, I need to come back in either five years or ten years. So, uh, if you are a gentleman of, say, over 40 or around that age, um, I do recommend getting it checked out. It, uh, the prep day sucks. It really does. Uh, but this wasn't that bad at all. Like, I don't know what time it is, but I don't think we've been here at all. Okay. I have been here roughly an hour, and it's completely done. We're just waiting on release. They said it'd be another probably 10 minutes, and then I should be able to get dressed. And uh, they were like, I can eat right afterwards, and nothing too greasy or spicy. Um, and then tonight I can have a good dinner, have anything. So, uh, yeah, uh, it, it, uh, I, th I think everybody should have this done uh, as you get older and everything because, uh, you know, colon cancer can be a serious thing. And uh, it's like, yeah, it's, it's really not that bad of a procedure. You just need a couple of days off and uh, it, it could really make a difference in your health. So, yeah. Uh, I, I may be rambling, uh, I'm still a little under the medication, but uh, I'm Uncle Gentleman, and uh, y'all have a great day. Okay, I am dressed. I am sort of lucid, but everything went great. A couple of little polyps that they took care of. Um, and we're ready to go, and I am really hungry. So we're gonna go get some food. And uh, I'll let you know how the rest of my day goes. So I'll check in a little bit later. So we're going home. Okay, we're on the way home now. Uh, we made a quick stop at uh, Okay Brothers. I don't know if I'm getting that in. Um, Cause uh, there, or is it Poke Brothers? Whatever. They have really good bowls. If you're ever in Nashville, uh, check them out. Um, 
but uh, Jen got a poke bowl there a while back and really liked it. So she's grabbing that uh, for her on the way home. And um, just because I haven't ate anything in a while, I think I'm gonna just get like a sandwich, somewhere something light. Um, but yeah, I mean, it, the, the, the procedure really wasn't that bad at all. The prep sucks, but you gotta do it. You, you have to follow the rules um, because if you don't, you, they may have to do it again and it'll suck twice. But procedure day really isn't that bad, honestly. And I mean, it, this is really important. So guys, girls, um, colon cancer can be the silent killer. It's like you may not know you have it until you start having serious symptoms. And by then it may be way too late. So it's like uh, if you're if you're over 40, um, get checked out. I mean, it's it's not the most comfortable thing to talk about and uh, I am uh, they filled me up with gas and everything after air afterwards so I am pooping a lot uh, so if you hear any weird noises in the background that's just me um, but uh, it, it really went fine and uh, I'm glad I got checked out because now I have that peace of mind that uh, I'm okay so uh, yeah uh, take care of yourself and uh, Make sure you'll be around for more. So, as you can see, the beard's growing out a little bit. Uh, there should be some shave videos coming up soon. Uh, I've been out of the loop for a while. I've been on the road for work. So, uh, but yeah, well, I'll be uh, posting some more stuff soon. So, uh, take care, everybody. Have a great day.